Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? What's up, too? Okay, bro, no video. I'm good for this. This Tuesday, I don't know if y'all. Okay, I probably the news, you know, all of them. Um, I seen I did video, but I don't know. I seen I did video to where they had. Um, say the two of the young Daveville suspects. Okay, one of them is um Hill twenty and Brown and that team. So they can get their um you for offender on um, request turned down. So they said that um they said that, you know a Tuscaloosa County judge has shut down you for offender request for two of the six suspects accused in Daveville deadly mass shooting earlier this this year according to the court filings. Court um circuit judge. William Watson has um denied youth offender status for Wilson, Lamar Hill Jr. and Willie George Brown Jr. So he was age twenty and Brown a nineteen were both scheduled for arraignment. Uh I said around December twenty eighth. The April birthday party shooting left four people dead, over thirty injured in local dance studio offices. Suspects are charged with religious murder. Okay, they had like turned down basically the youth offender status due to the age, and I guess they, uh, I guess I wanna like you know wanna I don't know wanna I say not give them youth status like that because like you know all of them are charged basically I said with murder how they had shot and killed a couple of teenagers you know in the party back around April to where they had like you know trying like you know trying to do the shooting I done how the shooting went bad. To a couple people got got killed, man, and something got injured, you know. But I feel like they, you know, it's a thing to worry. I think these these um suspects on the screen is doing a lot of time, so yeah, they're gonna get probably death penalty or life prison. So I and so I feel like you know, I don't know. I feel like judge probably might give them life prison. I say rock and roll, and so they had like you know trying to you know trying to shut down their youthful um. I said juvenile, um, youth for fitness studies, and I, and but I feel like they, you know, they are very much more, you know, I guess older people, and, um, you know, I feel like, you know, they are very much more young, so they probably 20, 19, 16, 18 years old, man, but I don't know, I feel like, you know, it's kind of sad to see about, you know, a family losing their loved ones to, uh, you know, due to gun violence going on, and so I feel like gun violence can be key affect a family, you know, it can affect a mother, you know, you know, uh, I feel like, you know, things that it can affect a family member if they're losing their son or daughter. Basically, the gun violence is going to know how gun violence can be a, a thing to where people, I guess, had to live with their, um, I say low one dying. But I feel like that these, these, um, these, um, these, um, five suspects are very much more or either... Sister Spence are very much more doing like time behind bars, you know. I guess I said, you know, what occurred back over a couple of couple of um months ago and how they are in jail now. Facing, you know, type of type of like a charge of murder, man, how they shot into the party, striking and killing everybody in the party, man. You know, how they had lost a couple of teenagers, you know, I guess they're supposed to graduate this year and how like, you know, football player had died. So I feel like, you know, they had shot and killed Couple teenagers and you know some got injured man in um the whole incident, but and so I feel like you know you know if you do a crime do the time but I feel like you know if you do a crime they could be evil, um heartless, ruthless, vicious man you need to be put in jail on time because you could you know have any to life but I feel like they you know these these um these men these these dumb asses on the screen is doing like time behind balls. I said what they did and how they end up, you know, killing, you know, taking life of another one. But I feel like they you know all of them are charged with murder and how they get life prison or death penalty, you know, in the state of, I said, of Alabama, man. So I feel like, you know, my state, Alabama, has the, the um I guess, the harsh, worst penalties ever, you know, it could be the chair or it could be put in life prison, I said, on parole. But I feel like they you know, be very much more. I say much more. I think scripted to have these type on um, type of people who who trying to meet crimes in the streets. I guess to put in jail for a time. But I feel like you know they all very more, probably it's gonna get kind of like much more scripted on these type of dudes or women out here who trying to I guess 
try to commit crimes out here, like shoot somebody, kill somebody, murder, rob thing, they occur any type of offense, but so they all are or now in jail, face them on charge and how they might not get out no more, man. So so I pass out P to those these um the victims who got killed in the past couple couple months, back around either on April so but so, so and so I pass out P to all of them so Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to Peace. I'm out here. Take care. Peace.